Astronomers using ESO's Very Large Telescope have recently found six galaxies trapped in the web of a supermassive black hole when the universe was less than a billion years old. This is the first time scientists detect such a close grouping within the first billion years of the universe. The discovery gives a better understanding of how supermassive black holes form and grow to their enormous size so quickly. It also supports the theory that black holes can grow rapidly within large web-like structures that contain plenty of gas to fuel them. This web of gas spans some 300 times the diameter of the Milky Way. At the center of this chaos sits a supermassive black hole, some one billion times the mass of the Sun. Scientists theorize that the very first black holes formed from the collapse of the first stars. They had to have grown very quickly to reach such masses within the first one billion years of the universe. But astronomers have found it hard to understand how much of this black hole fuel could have been available to enable these objects to grow to such enormous sizes in such a short time. The newfound structure offers a likely explanation. It seems like the spider's web and the galaxies within it contain enough gas to provide the fuel that the central black hole needs to quickly become a supermassive giant. You may ask how did such large web-like structures form in the first place? Astronomers say giant halos of mysterious dark matter are the answer. Regions of dark matter may attract huge amounts of gas in the early universe. The gas and dark matter could create the web-like structures where galaxies and black holes evolve. The newfound galaxies are some of the faintest ever found. That means there could be many more lurking in the area, and that's why scientists think they have just seen the tip of the iceberg. Lead author of the study, astronomer Marco Mignoli, said the research was mainly driven by the desire to understand some of the most challenging astronomical objects, such as supermassive black holes in the early universe. The research was published in Astronomy and Astrophysics, for which you can find the link down in the description. I'm Ardit the founder of Cosmonology and the creator of these videos and I just wanted to say hi.